So another founder in Cairo. So rechts afslaan. And this is a special one because this is from the 330E of my wife. She uh, cut her finger and she asked me to um, drive her to work and also now I'm taking the car with me again. Of course because I have to go to work as well. And this is a BMW out of 2016, a 330e with an M performance package. And this is a lovely car. The, the newest iteration. Of the BMW is now uh, both with a 330e and 330e. And this gives you the performance of that uh, 330 range. Eh? You have a 330i, 330 and 330e. 330i is uh, the gasoline equivalent and then you have 330d which is uh, the diesel equivalent of course and this one is the combined combined gasoline and electric uh, engine that you uh, have equipped here and the funny thing is they have a uh, a gasoline engine that is detuned, so it, it could have uh, a lot more horsepower, but they reduced it so that you have the electric engine together to get to the performance of a normal uh, 330i, which is the, uh, the gasoline equivalent. But once you uh, remove the redu reductions, for example by chip tuning or whatever, you can have like more than 100 horsepower uh, gains which are enormous even more enormous are the gains that can be made with that uh, new uh, 320e and why is that it's even a more uh, reduced it's a detuned version of uh, the same engine so you get instead of this which has 186 or 192 or something like that. Engine, it has like 160, 163 horsepower, and also the overboost function of the 330i uh, is now uh, reduced. It's not uh, there in the 320i, so 320e. So the overboost first function of the 330e is not present in the 320e so they have uh, managed to reduce some of the features to give it less uh, horsepower and to put something uh, below the 330e but those are just uh, some minor reductions if you would use uh, this car's engine capacity to its full capacity you would also uh, be very close in the performance if you tune both automobiles now you hear that the gasoline engine is also kicking in this one has uh, one um, modification to the exhaust system where why it sounds a lot deeper so you have um, Resonators, this car has uh, at the back even two. I think they have more if you go up the uh, stream, so towards the engine. And they have removed one to give it a more deeper, uh, bassy sound. Also, what's very nice about this car is that you have the benefits of an electric car for small trips, so reducing um, gasoline consumption, also costs. Also, you get a better road tax in the Netherlands. So that's half of a normal car of this weight, so that's a benefit. And you also have, uh, for example, if you have small trips, you don't have to warm up the engine because yeah, the electric engine can do this all by itself. This electric engine is part of the, the gearbox, so it's, it's, it is really nicely interwoven in this gearbox. And this gearbox has... Um, once in uh, gasoline mode, it has uh, eight speeds. And it's also fantastic, so you have a very nice automatic uh, shifting gearbox. It just does what it uh, has to do. And with uh, finesse, some must say. And this extra burble that this exhaust uh, gives uh, finishes this package because it has all kinds of M performance uh, parts. So 
the, all the spoilers on the front, on the back, but also the side skirts. It has uh, that uh, ducktail uh, back spoiler. It has carbon um, mirror caps. A really nice, uh, yeah, fantastic looking uh, vehicle. And it always also has an uh, M performance um, suspension setup, which is even lowered. Uh, a lot more, it also has this M performance brake package, which is big brakes. So, a fantastic driving uh, package, I must say. Also, it has a good balance between luxury and silence on one hand, and on the other hand, you could have fun and still uh, be an enthusiast driver. If you look at the drivetrain of this uh, 3 Series, it's very mature. It also is very uh, nice and direct because it also has big rims. So the, the, the tire walls are reduced even more, so you have a very direct feeling and also because of the sport suspension is even lowered more, of course you have to take care with speed bumps, but yeah that's with like a lowered car of course. Um, but even though this car weighs quite a lot, it, it doesn't feel sluggish at all, it feels very direct of course. BMW 3 Series without all that weight will feel even more direct, but this feels very well planted, especially with all these modifications. Yeah, it, this it performed, it's in performance even better. Uh, the tuning potential of this car is between 350 and 380 horsepower, stage one, which is ridiculously. Uh, a lot, but I also mentioned why this is the case uh, because the engine was detuned by purpose and can now be be de restricted. But with that kind of performance and the added torque of an electric engine, you would be seeing 650 uh, 700 newton meters of torque, which gives this car a very nice performance, especially with this eight speed uh, gearbox, which is uh, yeah, a lot faster than you could shift manually, but also you have eight gears. So you can keep the engine on boil all the time if you wish to do so. So a very nice driving package. I'm also proud of my wife that she uh, took this leap and uh, got this very nice car. The other thing is that this car is uh, in uh, black and uh, normally yeah, it could be a little bit of boring color but because of this car is so uh, covered with spoilers and so low and uh, yeah, very big rims and all the other stuff. This black color offers a little bit of uh, discreet look. Instead of, for example, if this would be in green or uh, yellow or gold or whatever, it would be very hard to, to miss it. And now you can have a little bit more subtlety to this uh, car, which I think is a very good uh, win. If this car was not uh, as it was not looking as it uh, would. I think my wife would have gone for a purple or blue or green one instead. But that gives you some of the background. There are also clips on my channel about this, uh, the sound of this exhaust system. Check them out. Very nice car. I hope you liked this video. Found new car. Out.